to configure a weekly timer. The fastest way is by the quick menu button located in the lower left side of the controller. Pick up the weekly timer setup icon in the lower left side of the controller. Edit the patterns by day, choosing the Yes option with the arrows. You are now in the patterns of the menu, which are arranged by hour, on or off, mode and degrees. Choose an initial hour. Choose to turn on or off your heating and cooling system. Choose the operation mode and the desired temperature. The new configuration will appear in your device. Go to the next line to choose when to turn it off or on depending on your previous choice. You may choose up to six configurations to activate or deactivate your heating and cooling system. You may copy the patterns previously configured to the other weekdays at your will. The Enable Weekly Timer Days will appear with a check mark. Those who are not activated will appear disabled, as shown in the pattern screen. Once you have configured your weekly timer, you may find the weekly timer icon in the remote controller main screen. We recommend to set up the weekly timer either in the remote controller or the Aquaria Smart Cloud, but in one of the devices only. Now, you can rely on your Aquaria system to function as you planned in your weekly schedule. Panasonic.